from this wonky curl to this bouncing ringlet, here's how to fix those face framing curls. It's a quick and simple fix to master the look. First, you will need water. Water is the first step in bringing that flexibility back to your curls because after your curl is already dried, it's set in whatever position, wonky or not. So wetting it, not soaking it completely so that it's dripping, but keeping it damp enough. You can also add gel or add hairspray to your fingertips to apply it to that one curl. And then we will start the re curling process. Choose your tool. I have makeup brushes here with all different diameters so you can choose one that will create the best natural looking curl for your hair. So no heat is required of course for this one. All you'll need to do is wind that curl around your tool of choice. Here I'm just using a makeup brush and then you'll just hold it there for about 15 to 30 seconds to let it dry and set in that position before pulling it straight down to create that bouncy ringlet. And here are some more tips to perfect this technique. You can use a spray bottle, but just apply the water only on that particular curl that you want to refresh. Then you can wind it around your tool of choice. You can also use a diffuser and just diffuse it for about 10 seconds or less and release the curl by pulling the wand straight down. And note that your curl pattern may change. There may be some parts of your hair that curl towards your face and other sections of your hair that curl back. So always curl in the direction that your hair already wants to go and that'll create the tightest curl for you. And of course, if you need to refresh more, you can use the same technique of dampening curl by curl and applying product to really smooth down the curls, maintain definition, and you're all set. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.